world of Centauri 5, fifth planet in the Centauri system, a vacation getaway of unparalleled splendor. From its expansive beaches to its majestic trinary yes. sunsets, it's easy to see why Centauri 5 is one of this century's most visited vacation destinations. Place your hand on the screen to begin booking your trip. Error. Your transaction cannot be completed at this time. Just, yeah. Error. Handprint not accepted. Come on. Error. Handprint not accepted. Error. Handprint not accepted. Your transaction cannot be completed at this time. Well, clearly this thing is biased against charismatic ladies, man. Perhaps you could get it to work. Computer, recalibrate sensors for overcompensating males repeating their senior year. Oh, touche. Invalid request. Paging next available attendant. Your attendant has arrived. Welcome to Sky's the Limit Rentals. How can I assist you? Yeah, this, um, this automatic system doesn't seem to be working here. Let me handle this. Clearly, this machine is racist. And after such unwarranted persecution, it seems only fair that, uh, that you book our shuttle at a reduced rate. Not that money is a problem for us. It would just be nice to, to have a little extra for, say, drinks and dinner next week with a beautiful acquaintance. May I see your hand, please? If you're wondering why my hands feel so strong, it's because they are. Oh, this is interesting. It says here you booked your shuttle over a week ago. Does it say anything about my piercing blue eyes? It does not. It does, however, give a detailed summary of your 35 transit violations, 10 counts of reckless flying, uh, 20 unpaid docking tickets. I paid those. Flying with an expired license. Uh, my registration probably got lost on the data stream. Flying on a closed airway. I've done that. Everybody does that. <laughs> Failure to yield at a crosswalk. Who hasn't done that? Who hasn't? Improper child restraint. Well, I let my sister fly for her 10th birthday. It was really cute. And right? a code 34. Indecent exposure on a public fairway. Well, to be fair, it was rush week, and I was very drunk. Mr. Matthews. Please, Mr. Matthews is my father. Call me Devin. Mr. Matthews, it is our policy only to rent crafts to those citizens with perfect flight records. Can we just put the ship on my name? It shouldn't be a problem, as long as you have a clean flight record. His record is so clean you could put it in your mouth. <sighs> um. Handprint accepted. Well, at least his hands are good for something. Oh, beautiful, accommodating, and hilarious. You know, we really do have so much in common. You can pick your ship up outside on the landing dock. Uh, where would be a good place to pick you up? I'll be here when you boys get back. You just bring that ship back in one piece and we'll talk about it then. It's a date. And you boys behave yourselves now. And be careful. We will. We're very responsible. I know you want to be my friend. Why would I buy what you give it away? Oh. So tell me, please, what is your name? <laughs> Try to give me something I can explain. Wow, you're or so strong. You sure that's not our armpits? You must have been a great warrior in a past life. Maybe a goddess. No, definitely a warrior. That girl's a riot man. What'd you find her? <laughs> Who, uh, Flower? I met her at the ceramics lab. You know, she grows this shit herself. Ceramics lab? Is that where you meet these girls? Hey, don't knock the ceramics lab. I get more pussy there than most people get in their lifetime. <laughs> Do you mean next? Oh, okay. Um, your aura is pink, so that means you're basically... A slut. 
whore. Lady of the night. <laughs> yeah. Fuck you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Give it up, man. You got no shot. Look, I'm just saying, you've been pining away over this girl since freshman year. If it was gonna happen, don't you think it would've happened by now? Besides, if you did have a shot, your fragile frame would not make it through the mating process. Oh, come on, man. That's not nice. Well, I'm just saying, she's more of a guy than I am. <coughs> Probably has a bigger dong, too. much to drink? Oh, that or I'm pregnant. <laughs> yeah, but you're not. Are you? Relax, I'm just fucking with you. <sighs> I took a test before we left. Don't worry, you're off the hook. No, this that's not what I was saying. I'm, you know, there's a lot worse things that could happen than, you know. Uh, look, I take care of you. Let's not start this whole thing again. What? You're one of my best friends. What happened last week was a mistake. I've just got too much going on right now to even think about a boyfriend. The interplanetary track finals are next month, and then exams, and then, I mean, who knows, internship, job? I don't really want to have to take another person's life into consideration when I'm trying to plan my future. What you reading? It's just a book for one of my classes. Books are awesome. What's it about? Well, it's kind of advanced. Avionics? Yeah, avionics. I took you? that class last semester. <laughs> if you like avionics, you're going to love advanced flight dynamics. You took advanced flight dynamics? Yeah. All those brains, he still can't figure out how to get laid. Guess he has been having a bit of a dry spell lately. Ah, uh, drought is more like it. I bet you 50 credits he can't weld that gap this entire trip. You're on. All right. How much longer until we get there? What's the matter, big track star? Can't you handle a little in-flight partying? Computer, how long till we land? Program destination, Centauri 5. Fifth planet in the Centauri system. Yes, get the sales pitch. How long till we get there? Estimated time to destination, 26 hours, 34 minutes. <sighs> 26 hours? Affirmative. Computer, double your speed. Invalid request. Flight speed cannot exceed 10x. 10x? My grandmother flies faster than 10x. Flight speed cannot exceed 10x. Oh, that's bullshit. That's 2x below the legal limit. It's a constrictor. Velocity inhibitor. It's a device that keeps the ship from exceeding a certain speed. Rental companies put them on ships like this all the time for insurance purposes. Well, can you take it off? The constrictor? Yeah, I'd like to get there at some point this century. Eh, I don't know, man. Messing with the ship's hardware like that, it can be pretty dangerous. That sounds like a terrible idea. Yeah, I'm with Shelly. You wish. <laughs> I say do it. What's the worst that could happen? Well, that's two against two. I think Flower should cast the deciding vote. But I don't get a say in this? <laughs> mm -mm. Do it, Avionics. <sighs> Fuck it. I'm in. How's it looking? Don't rush me. Think I've almost got it. 
There. Yeah, baby, Centauri 5, here we come. Centauri 5, fifth planet in the Centauri system. Surface composition. Can it, you hunk of junk? Sean, you might want to take a look at this. Awesome. <laughs> what was that? I need to see what's going on out there. Error. It's pretty banged up, but I think you'll be okay. <laughs> what's happening? Computer display visual now. Oh my god. Object approaching. Then get us out of here! Invalid request. Autopilot offline. Hold up! We're trying! <laughs> Make it stop! Computer! Divert all remaining power to the act thrusters now! Computer, what is our current location? Navigation systems offline. Location unknown. Computer ship status. Structural damage. Hull at 40%. Oxygen leak detected. Air levels at 40%. Hope you got insurance on this thing. Computer, initialize distress beacon. Distress beacon. 
offline. Oh, fuck, this is all my fault. Don't worry. The universe will take care of us. Computer, what is the atmospheric composition of this planet? 80% nitrogen. 19% oxygen. So we can breathe? Affirmative. Computer, how long until total system failure? Total system failure in 2 hours, 23 minutes. We've got no choice. We've got to try and land on this planet. How are we going to land the ship without the navigation system? We're going to have to plot the course manually. No. No. No, no, I, I couldn't even take off the constrictor. What makes you think I can plot the course to the surface of some unknown planet? Why don't we just wait here for someone to find us and help us? Without a distress beacon, we could be orbiting this world for months before anybody finds us. We don't even know if there's anybody down there. You're right, but we do know that we can breathe, which we won't be able to do for much longer if we stay up here. Bummer. Do you know what could happen if I make a mistake? We could burn up in the atmosphere. Or, or, or go into a stall, fall out of the sky. If we come in too hot, we'll be ripped apart. John, I know you feel this is your fault. But right now, you're the only option we have. Sean, you're the only one with the skills to get us out of this mess. Okay. Let me make some calculations. System failure in 59 minutes. Sean? Anglo descent. Gravitational pull. Fuel supplies. Sean, we're running out of time. You've checked those figures four times already. If we're going to do this, it has to be now. You're right. Okay. One of you is going to have to fly the ship while I interpret the data stream. I'll do it. Uh... Relax. We can do this. Alright. Start by bringing the nose of the ship down at a 45 degree angle. Then give the rear thrusters a short burst. Whoa, whoa, that's enough. He's up. All right. You need to pull the nose up so that the bottom of the ship is parallel to the surface of the planet. Just hold on. It's about to get rough. Large S 
50 degrees! We need to go up 50 degrees! Warning. Oxygen level at 25%. Warning. Hull integrity at 5%. Hold her still. I'm gonna try and reset the bone. Oh, no, this is gonna hurt. So hold her still. I'm trying. Four of us will set out and look for help. Hopefully we can find someone with a long-range transmitter powerful enough to call home. We'll call you on the communicator every couple of hours to check in. While we're gone, we need you to try and fix what you can on the ship. See if you can get the distress beacon working. If there's no one out there, it might be our only shot of getting rescued. Hey, man. Get us down safe. I'll just get us home.
sure is a good idea to leave Sean and Flower back there. Sean's the only one who knows how to fix the ship, and Flower's in no condition to walk. Besides, if the ship's banged up beyond repair, we're going to have to go look for help at some point. You sure you don't want to stay back at the ship? Don't worry about me. I got a head like a rock. Yeah, they're brain to match. <laughs> <laughs> how are you doing? I'm OK. I'm a little sore from the crash. A little malicious. I'm getting there. Hey, look at that. Let's check it out. like some sort of fire. This place is more burned out than flour. What do you think cost it? Years of recreational drug use. <laughs> he meant the fire, jackass. Gotta tell Sean what we found. No, it sounds like the communicator's on the fritz or something. Did you check these before we left? Yeah, definitely. You are so full of shit. I may have forgotten to check them before we left. Come on. What, these are supposed to be emergency communicators. Why wouldn't they work? Um, I don't know, maybe because we were in a crash landing? Okay, okay, look, maybe it's just the mountains blocking the signal. Yeah, the mountains. We'll check when we get over the next hill. Did I see that? See what? I thought I saw something moving up there along the ridge. I don't see anything. Hello? Somebody out there? Hello? Hello? Probably just the wind. Come on, let's pick up the pace. I want to get over this mountain before the sun starts to set. That's what I'm talking about. You're not seriously gonna go in there? Fuck, yes I am. What does it look like I'm doing? Trying to blind us with your milky white boy chest? <laughs> look, we've been walking all day. Let's just take a little swim. We really should keep moving. Flowers back there with a broken leg and Sean's... Relax, Mom. We'll just stay five minutes. If she's resting, she should be fine. And besides, we could all use a break. All right, just five minutes, then we keep moving. Come on in, the water's great.
can't help myself. You're such an easy target. Did you see that? See what? There was someone there on the rocks. Nobody's there. There's someone there. I saw someone. Hello? Anybody? Nobody there. I know what I saw. There's someone there. Well, they're not there now. Where are you going? Not safe here. I hate that you're leaving. I love watching you go. And just when they thought it was safe, they heard something moving in the bushes. <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. What's your problem? She thinks there's something out there. Mm. I know what I saw. Well, like that time you saw the terrorist attack? How was she supposed to know the city was demolishing a building? No, or, or when she mistook the fire drill for an air retire and she hid <laughs> under the desk. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot about that. <laughs> you guys are assholes. Oh, come on. Christy. No, you don't have to go. Oh, Look, we're on, just kidding. Come back. Come on. Christy. Who are we going to make fun of? me. Jesus, you nearly took my head off. What do you get for sneaking up on somebody? You know, you're pretty brave for such a paranoid person coming out here in the woods all by yourself. There's someone out there. Look. Oh, yeah. This looks like that guy you hooked up with at that frat party a couple weeks ago. Okay. Stop fucking around, okay? There's somebody out there. I saw him. He was watching us at the lake. Come on. It's probably just an animal or something. got skewered. System. Oxygen. Pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Great. Yeah. Analysis complete. Computer launch distress beacon. Negative. Negative, why not? Restricted location. All channels blocked. This is a restricted location? Authorization code required. Please enter your authorization code now if you wish to continue. I must have wired something wrong. We're in the middle of nowhere. Please enter your authorization code now. Computer ship diagnostic. Hull integrity at 5%. Oxygen depleted. Air tanks Computer. breached. Hello? Jack? Devin, is that you?
Hello? Look, we have an injured girl here who needs help. Someone there. Hello? Is anybody out there?
close. Door mechanism disabled. Oxygen tank breached. Manual override, shut the door. If you close the doors, you will suffocate. Air level critical. Oxygen tank breached. Shut the door, now! Toxic in 30 minutes. What is it? It looks like some kind of animal trap. See, I told you there was something out here. Relax, we are looking for help after all. Yeah, help getting home, not getting body bagged. If there was something out there that wanted to hurt us, don't you think it would have done it by now? Maybe they're just waiting for the right moment. Yeah, maybe you're just paranoid. What was that? What was what? That, did you hear that? That I heard. Hello? Somebody there? Hello? What the fuck was that? <laughs> we should go, like right fucking now.
Warning. Repressurization failed. Asphyxiation imminent. Air level toxic in five, four, three, two, one. Computer override. Cabin air quality restored. Please state your next command. I don't know. I mean, it was like we were in the middle of a fucking war zone down there. What were those things? I don't know. Oh, this is fucked up. This is really fucked up. Just calm down. Calm down? God, how can I calm down? There are people down there trying to kill us. Did you see what they did to Christy? Of course I saw it. I was standing right next to you. We just need to calm down. Okay, just, just for a minute. We just need to calm down and think through what we're going to do next. It's infected. What's gonna happen? Here. Take these. What are those? Tranquilizers. We were gonna take them when we got to Centauri 5. No. no. No, these will put you out. They should slow the spread of the infection. Look, if the infection reaches your heart, you could die. I promise I won't let anything happen to you. How long do you fix the ship? I don't know if I can. So what do you think we should do? I think we should put as much distance between us and them as possible. What if there's more of them? Out there? Then we're fucked. I think we should stay here. Just until morning. What if they come up here? Then we'll run. Oh, great plan. At least out here we can see someone coming from a ways off. They won't be able to hide in the bushes. Can I have a word with you quickly? Look, man, we're lucky to be alive. If we want to stay that way, we have to leave like now. But she's got a point. We should stay until morning. We don't know what else is out there, and at least this way. No, we're... are you out of your fucking what? mind? We are sitting ducks up here. And I don't know if you were paying attention earlier, but besides those things in the woods, there are guys with guns, big guns. The kind you could shoot people with from like a million fucking miles away. Dude, we can't go running off into the forest again. We can't see what's coming. Yeah, maybe not, but it's better than staying up here waiting to be picked off. It's not safe. I'm going whether you guys are coming or not. Devin. Devin, come on, man. We gotta stay together. Devin! Devin! Repair analysis. Repairs complete. 
Navigation system online. Warning. Hull integrity at 5%. Computer, repressurize the oxygen tanks. Let's get the fuck out of here. Repressurizing. Commencing. Error. Repressurization failed. Shit. Oxygen tank breached. Cabin pressure cannot be restored. Door mechanism malfunction. Please service at the next possible convenience. Yeah, yeah, one thing at a time. Something out here. It's a junk. Computer, repressurize the tanks. Repressurizing commencing. Flight systems online. Please state your next command. destination. You okay? I'm gonna miss her, Shelley. She was like my sister.
We have to go find Evan and get back to the ship. How are we gonna find him? Can follow his tracks. Come on. Hey, look at this. There's a second set of tracks. Maybe found help? Did you hear that? contact with the remaining civilians. Over here. Over here. Sean? Over here. Over here. Over here. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Now tell me who you are. Take the prisoners to the crematorium at sector 2 and incinerate them. 
Once they're disposed of, reconvene with your unit in Sector 4 and resume the clearing process. Yes, sir. Get up! execution. We gotta get the hell out of here. Lights out, asshole. This is a military uniform. Must be some sort of surface occupation. Extermination's more like it. Last night when I left, I saw hundreds of these guys in the valley. They were shooting at those things in the forest, executing them and burning their bodies. They're obviously trying to cover up whatever it is they're doing out here. They said something on the communicator about resuming the clearing process. Last night when I left, even though it was dark, from what I could make out, it was like they were setting up construction markers in the forest. It's like they were prepping the planet for something. Some really fucked up black ops government conspiracy type shit. Maybe they're trying to set up a human colony. No, the Terrestrial Rights Coalition has never allowed the settlement of inhabited worlds. Even ones with creatures like these. Exactly. This is an uncharted planet. If they can get rid of any evidence of a pre-existing species... They can do whatever the fuck they want. Then why come after us? We're human. We're witnesses. Computer, set up a comm link to communications number 91344 Bravo. Error. Restricted location. Authorization code required. Please enter your authorization code now if you wish to continue. Access granted. Battalion commander here. Report. Sir, there is one female crash survivor. She claims they were not able to establish communications before entering the planet's atmosphere. The ship's log indicates the same. No transmissions were made after takeoff. Good work. Execute the female, and then wait for the disposal unit to arrive and remove the ship. When you're finished, reconvene with the rest of your unit in Sector 4. Yes, sir. Understood. Anything useful in there? Yeah, these will come in handy. Still nothing? No. Try his communicator. It's a shame to have to kill such a pretty little thing. Oh. Working. Oh, Sean, Flower, 
Come in. Did you read me as Jack? What the fuck? Is anybody there? Hello? Are you guys there? Please come in. Digital frequencies. There's Alpha Zeta Echo. We have an event level situation. I repeat. Pass me through to set the control. Clearance code 8942 Delta Bravo. Sean, flower, come in, please. Uh. Uh. Is anybody there? Hello? Welcome to Central Control. I need a remote shutdown of comm line 32980. I'm not getting anything. Wrong move, bitch. Locating signal. Sean, Flower? Is anybody there? Please respond. Please answer us. Was that you? Tracking signal. Yes. Where's Sean? Are you guys okay? I don't know. Warning. Restricted channel. Remote override code 857. Hello? Disrupting Hello, channel. Here? Warning. Restricted channel. Remote override code. Transmission terminated. We need to get back to the ship. What are we gonna do with him? Leave him. He'll get what he deserves.
of them, we can't fight them all. We don't want to fight you. Too far, there's no way. We'll make it, we have to. Just stay close to me. They're too fast, I can't. You have to go on without me, you can make it. I'm not leaving you no matter what. Why didn't they follow us? Tag, you're in. Take the prisoners to the crematorium in Sector 2 and incinerate them. Copy that. Jack! You have to leave me. I'm not leaving you. Go now!
where's Sean? Sean's dead. I found his body outside the ship before we took off. And the others? I don't want to die. We're safe now. No one else is going to die. at 5%. Let's go home. 